Hi, I'm Tim Torres from the Jersey Journal. I'm back in Hoboken on a sweltering June afternoon to see what's up with the busy intersection. Well, we came back today and it looks like the city has responded. They're actually building traffic lights to uh, fix the problem. In maybe a couple of weeks it might be completed, but uh, I don't know, I don't know. I don't know about the county executive, it's not politically involved in this, I don't know about that. So. Okay, but uh, people have been complaining a lot, right? I mean, this, this, this is a big problem intersection. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, you can see when people walk by, cars don't stop either, way. Right? Yeah. right. So everybody comes by like, yeah! And <laughs> like, five seconds of mail time! Uh, we had an inquiry from a woman who was calling up about the uh, traffic light or the problem with congestion over by Starbucks and um, basically I just said that uh, you know this city has uh, applied for a permit to do the traffic light it's all done through the State Department of Transportation and it's going up now. It's a long process because it's not the city that does it, it's the state. Sure. So the, the, I guess they do traffic studies just to you know, monitor everything and it goes up. It's too much. Too much. Too many people. You can't drive. Right. You have to wait for another car to come this way. So many people. Okay. You can run over by them. I think the traffic light is good because when pedestrians be passing, they don't have to be worrying about getting hit by a car and, and waiting for the policeman to flag you away. Like you got to get across. Sometimes you can't even cross because there's so many cars passing by and you got to get to work or you got to get a rush. You might get hit by a car. You know, you don't need that. You have to start off the morning, especially without coffee. You know? Sure. <laughs>